Welcome to Dan ARG YouTube. Captain Osa, we died a few months ago for London. A dead body don't reach Benin City, Edo State today. Apostle Alfred Uyinosa, the man where they talk about be, don't remember Captain Osa. How Captain Osa take bless him, give him job, make he do. Make I leave you now, make you hear from Apostle Alfred Uyinosa. Yeah, God bless everyone, my people, my brothers, on a good evening, good afternoon, good morning, depending on the location, on how for the connect with me this evening. General Captain Osa, may your soul rest in peace. May your soul rest in perfect peace. Of a truth, nothing did his life. Of a truth, nothing did his life. There is nothing on this planet Earth worth dying for. Nothing did this planet Earth worth dying for. General Captiosa. May your soul rest in perfect peace. May God comfort your family. May God comfort your friends and loved ones. May your soul rest in perfect peace. Indeed, there is nothing on this earth there is nothing worth fighting for. Absolutely nothing. Absolutely nothing. Nothing worth fighting for. I remember Captain Osa, election aside, election is gone and it's gone for and gone forever. The positive side of Captain Osa. I will say it today, though I have never said it before, I will say it today. As an architect, I work with one engineer, William A. Raga. Now me, the design, the most of his plan, and I me, also the help engineer, William A. Raga, the supervise the project. Engineer William Araga, Naim be the man, when he carried my hand, of course I know the young Captain Osa for years, of course I've been hearing about him. Engineer William Araga, carried my hand, I mean, he carried my hand, go meet Captain Osa, when Captain Osa, they ask or they look for who want design plan. Then engineer William Iraga tell us, ah, he get one architect with a design plan. They call me Uyi, they call me Uye Do. That's the name. William Iraga, they call me. Then William Iraga carry me go Captain Osa house. The very first time he called me for phone. He called me for phone. Because I come in Captain, they are coming in for Captain's house. I did pass Captain's house. I never enter before. Then, as he said, me make a brief plan. The back, that I back, they don't take. The back when they carry me go Captain's house. Can't get accident for road. I come for P leg. As I enter Captain's house, I did, I call it drag leg because I needed to meet with him. And Captain said, "Maybe say they keep to appointment." I said, "Just see, see me." And you know what? Because I post to Alfred, uh, we had no what happened. I said, "I get accident with bike or because ah, you don't get motor." I said, "No, I don't have any car." Because uh, we let call him. He said, "Ah, why be saying now when he want to introduce me to Captain Osa?" 
Now the back will carry me get, get accident. I said, no, no. Then Cap Chosa just asked, can you design the plan? I said, yes. There and there we agree on price. He paid me cash. That time money get value. He said, money to your boy. Immediately, I designed the plan. The first plan when I designed for Captain, I did for I go back see me. I designed a plan. From there, Captain Sir Network, sorry. Captain Sir fell in love with me immediately. I started working for Captain Sir through engineer William Iraga and the design most of the plan. To the extent he gave a William work for Nava Base, Port Harcourt. Now me, then they still call. Apostle, follow them, go Port Harcourt. Through engineer William Iraga. I interpret the plan in Nava Base, Port Harcourt. Now engineer William Iraga, through Captain and I can go Port Harcourt to go do that plan. After that plan, we come back to Benin. Work day. Then the house where they stay, that street, that street, there's a corridor, twist building. I also interpret the plan. Pegan, true engineer William Iraga. True engineer William Iraga. That was that became close to Captain Osa. I worked for him and uh, politics came. Politics came and uh, we needed to speak for God, the Godwin of Baseki. And I did a broker that very day analyzing what Captain Osa said that was wrong. Captain Osa does not really know, need to know you before I bless you. Captain Osa, may so rest in peace. He blessed me, and this is the truth. And nothing but the truth. I draw many plans for him. That I can go in house anytime. Once I come, you're not saying that and I come. They call me Uyi. Then the Gina William called me Uyi Do. When that Captain Osa compound, it was then I knew that Captain Osa was a free man. He has me like my car. That's the truth. It has been like pilgrimage. Because like people they go pilgrimage. You know what I mean? People go there all the time. People know they drive a house. The other man they call Christ. A member of House of Assembly, Orlando West. I knew Christ through Captain Osa. Uh, Christ uh, Kyben. Christ first house. Now me builder and I mean designer by the grace of God. There's absolutely nothing you want to tell me about Captain Osa. Yes. In defense for Basa Kim made a lot of force to really say stand up to say no. We know we grieve for oppression. But deep down in our hearts, we know the truth. Deep down in our hearts, we know the truth. I know I did a broadcast to say no, Captain Osa. Mm -mm. What I say? But I never insulted him. I only know Captain Osa, but I never. Oh, I was. Yeah, sorry, the network was really, really bad. Network was really, really bad. You know, Captain Osa was a man of the people. May so rest in peace. May so rest in peace. Sorry, the network was really bad. You know, this country, we're not going to have things to go now. So, as I was saying, Captain Osa house be like Jerusalem. People, they come into Captain Osa house when he was alive. He was a man of the people, whether we like it or not. And Captain Osa not really need to know you before he help you. Before I support you, before I bless you, 
My life is a living witness to this. I've been hearing of Captiosa, but a man called Engineer William Eraga took me to Captiosa's house on that fateful day because I'm an architect by profession. So when Captiosa they look for Hugo design plan, that was how Engineer William Eraga introduced me to Captiosa to begin to design all his building plan. Through Captiosa, I go to go do, go build house for Nava Base. For Nava Base. That was how Nasua Ate no Nava, Nava Base to go build hosted for the Nava officer. Whether we like it or not, Captiota has departed life and may his soul rest in peace. May his soul rest in peace. I go feel count the numbers of houses when I build and supervise for Captiosa through engineer William Eraga. Engineer William Eraga. My first encounter with Captiosa on that fateful day, he sent for me. That's my first day to enter the house. After they go, the back when they carry me, come get accident. If I want to enter a red hour, that's my back night they ring for Benin. I come for P leg. I come manage reach their house. As I enter Captiota compound, now I quarrel with engineer William Iraga. Ah! Which place you bring come, come, come ask now? Where they decay leg? Now say, ah! I get accident to Because okay. He holds a cigar for hand. They smoke. And uh, immediately he asked me, he said, Uyi, at least Uyi is my name. Then, uh, Engineer William called me, uh, uh, Uyedo. Now, Uyedo, now Engineer William, they call me. So, then the captain said, uh, Uyi, your feet don't say, no problem, sir. We agree on price. Captain Osan paid me cash immediately. That time, about 50 times. Money get value, not be now, be say, 50 times, not receive it, where you now receive do subscription. Uh, for uh, for they buy data for your phone. That was the first build plan when I designed for Captain Osa through engineer William Iraga. Then the first plan was in uh, I go back to me, I go back to me, duplex. Now me draw that plan for Captain Osa for I go back to me. I designed that plan for for Captain Osa in I go back to me. Go I go back to me. You will see the duplex there. Now me. By the grace of God, now design that plan, supervisor for Captiosa through engineer William Iraga. Are you Gerald? So, from there, the relationship between me and Captiosa began to grow. The relationship began to grow. From there, Captiosa House, that's his street. If you go front, after we are PDP Secretary that day, there are one twin, two building, the same pattern. That mean they designed the plan. Then Cap uh, Engineer William Iraga was the builder, my own, to the state site, the monitor, the project. A lot of beauty when I help uh, Captain Osa do, and Captain Osa don't owe anybody. Captain Osa does not owe anybody. Captiosa does not hold anybody. And once you do job for him, he they pay you straight ahead. True Captiosa, now no Christ, no be Christ or cabin in the column for House of Assembly. I know true Captiosa, now no Christ. Not that Christ was just a boy. Christ was just a boy. 
Chris was just a boy. Excuse me. Chris was just a boy. Was just a boy. That I never would dream to enter the house of assembly. No. Chris or Captain never would dream to enter the house of assembly. Chris or Captain's first house, not me, build them by the grace of God. I designed the plan through Edgina William Iraga. Let me design the plan for JROI. Then Chris never would think of saying, want to join, he want to uh, join politics. You know they did that time. Captosa single handedly sponsor Chris and all the rest. Why they talk this thing? This has been my encounter with Captosa until the election came. Now, election make me open mouth to do broadcast against Captosa. Because of what we felt that it was not too right then. I, I, I queried some of the utterances made by Captiosa. And the video went viral. Captiosa saw the video. Captiosa saw the video. He watched the video. A lot of persons, they, they, they were not happy. They were not happy. But because we needed to speak for Governor Gordon of Baseki, we some of our true caution to the wind because we just felt that oh uh, the oppression we know agree for this oppression. General Captain Osa, may your soul rest in peace. The great General Captain Osa, may your soul rest in peace. Politics aside. Of a truth, there is nothing on this earth. And there is nothing worth dying for. There is, no, there is nothing worth dying for. You know what I'm... Nothing worth dying for. Captain Osama, may your soul rest in peace. You are no more today, but I can still tell your story. Captain Osama blessed me. And this is the truth and nothing but the truth. This is the truth. People know they finish for Captosa House. People know they finish for Captosa House. People they come for head. I don't think can the numbers of time. I don't enter Captosa House. They the last upstairs, the upstairs where they did Captosa compound for the back. I supervise that building. Where swimming pool day. The back where they call rebuild, I supervise it. I supervise it. Captain's house was like Jerusalem. People come to seek for help 24 7. The fact that you, you were not privileged to know him, that doesn't mean that he was a bad man. I was privileged to be blessed by him. And this is the truth and nothing but the truth. But because of the fight for election and to defend God, you know, Basaki, I spoke against Captain Osa. And this is the truth. I spoke against him because I needed to defend the, the, the God, you know, Basaki and the Edo people. To defend the Edo people, I spoke against Kaptosa, and this is the truth. And nothing but the truth. But after election, what next? What next? There is nothing on this edge worth dying for. I have learned my lesson. I have learned. I have learned. There is nothing worth dying for. No politician worth dying for. Nobody worth dying for. A lot of the people running out. Oh, Captosa, Captosa. They don't really know him. Beware of Judah. Beware of Judah. 
beware of Judah. May the soul of Captivus rest in peace. Through Captivus and I enter Port Harcourt, go work for Nava Base. Yes. I have never been to Nava Base before. Now Captivus are carrying me go to Nava Base, go, go, go build house through engineer William Iraga. I can put the man on call through engineer William Iraga. Engineer William Iraga was the official builder for Captain Osa. Anywhere uh, Captain Osa would build us, now, Cap, now, uh, now engineer William Iraga, now be the official builder. I was the architect. I was the architect who worked designing their plan. Captain Osa, may your soul rest in peace. I have learned my lesson not to carry enemy because of anybody. I carry enemy. Captures have become my enemy at that particular time because of a lesson. Which doesn't really worth it. Which does not really worth it. My brother, there is nothing on this earth. There is absolutely nothing worth dying for. Nothing worth dying for. You cannot die for any man. With everything he has done, who still remember? That's the reason why I am doing this broadcast publicly to tell the whole world how I also benefited from Capturosa. Every day I think such a great man. May we not fall into the hands of wrong advisor. May we not support those that will kill us. A lot of people who benefited from him but they never stood for him including me, just because of a lesson, I spoke against him. But thank God I never insulted him. I never. I only pointed, point out a lot of different errors. That's all. May his soul rest in peace. Play, 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 capture side is gone. Good afternoon, God bless you. Play, 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 play. Capturosa is gone. We are losing great men. May so rest in peace. There is nothing on this earth worth dying for. Absolutely nothing. Nothing. I have learned my lesson. Never to speak against those God brought your way, no matter the political differences, no matter the differences. Never. I'm alive today telling the story. Every one of us have the same story, different story. I couldn't go to his burial because I know a lot of people are still angry with me. This is the truth. A lot of persons are still angry because, oh, Apostle spoke against the, uh, Captosa. I couldn't go. I couldn't go. Indeed, Captosa was a general. Oh my God, we mean, take it off from your, from your mind. I have learned my lesson never to allow politics or speaking for anybody cause enmity between me and my brother. Because politicians are not worth dying for. 
politicians are not what they're in for, irrespective of their level, they are not what they're in for. Even the people he stood for, they abandoned him. Agbona Anadobaife, Agbona RACIG. We are losing prominent people every day in this town. My heart is bleeding. My heart is bleeding. Captain Sam, may your soul rest in peace. May God comfort you. May God comfort your children. May God comfort your loved ones. Of the truth, I benefited from Captosa. But the reason of the plan when I draw for her and the houses I designed for him. If you go out, I, I, I go back to see me for Jaroy, the one house we did there. I designed one of the duplex there and built it on my Captosa. I can begin to count several beauty. I supervise and design for late Captain Osa. But because of election, I spoke against him. Let's be very careful. May the soul of Captain Osa Rest in peace. May the soul of Captiosa rest in peace. May so rest in perfect peace. May so rest in perfect peace. Et ye bo, ni non se we rude lejon. O wa non se we ne, et ye bo ne rude lejon. A lejon will come and go, but the people still remain. A lejon will come and go, but the people still remain. Nobody worth dying for. Nobody worth dying for. Nobody worth dying for. Captain Osa, may your soul rest in perfect peace. May God comfort your family. May God comfort your children. May God comfort your in-laws and loved ones. Why give my why give my boy auto level? No matter what, why give my boy auto level? Why give my boy auto level? Why give my boy auto level? Auto level no boom man we ever turn away. Give my boy an wala wawo. Wawoma amek bezo settle me immediately. Wawoma amek bezo settle it immediately. Why ki magik be all do level? And if you get issue with your brothers and sisters, settle it. Don't carry it to any media. Don't no carry your brother into media. No carry your system enter media, no matter which you do. Go to one and settle the differences. But no carry enter media. For all my two brothers and sisters, I beg, if you get misunderstanding with your brothers and sisters, settle immediately. Why? Because now only who they are alive, now go feel talk we ain't sleep. Who don't die, no go feel talk we ain't sleep. All the my all my all our brothers and sisters in Nigeria and in diaspora. 
when they get quarreled with their brothers and sisters, go and make settlement. Enough of those social media war. Enough. Why Allah will war. All our Bini, media, blogger, drop your weapon, cease fire. Cease fire. Why did you get a young Bima? Why did you get a Bima? Why did you get a Bima? It's not necessary. Why did you get a Bima? It's not necessary. Agbona, I don't do by fee. Agbona, I can be safe here. I want to win with him, woman. What am I saying to our who? Generational problem. It could continue like that. On behalf of late Captain Osa and, uh, and the entire family, I want to say I am sorry for the broadcast I did against late Captain Osa during the election. I want to say I'm sorry. Sorry. I'm sorry. I was only fighting for a better I do. Otaho a bogey. What love war. All the social media war, everybody drop your weapon. Drop your weapon. Drop your misa. Drop your bazooka. Drop everything. Let us join together to build our state. <laughs> Make we join together to build our state. Please, you get misunderstanding with your brothers and sisters. No carry and go social media. Don't carry it to social media. Don't carry it to social media. When you do, the stigma will be there forever. 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 Yeah, tribute to Captain Usa. May so rest in peace. May God comfort his family, his children, and his loved ones. May so rest in peace. May so rest in peace. Settle with your brother, settle with your sister before it will be too late. Settle with your brother, settle with your sister before it will be too late. And I repeat, you get issue with your brother, you get with you with your sister, do not carry it to social media. Never. For my Benin brothers and sisters, we get issue right now. When they can go social media, please drop your weapon. Drop your weapon. Withdraw that media wall. Withdraw that media wall and let peace reign. Why allow a war? Let peace reign. This is the message I have this evening. God bless you. Captain Osa, may your soul rest. In perfect peace. God bless your family. A door must be great. Thank you and good night. Now we don't hear from Apostle Alfred Uyinosa. Let us know what you think for comment session. If you never subscribe to Dan ARG YouTube, try make you subscribe so that make you for the hear all the things where they happen for a those state. Make I leave you now with this video. Make you help us share them. Thank you for watching Dan ARG YouTube.